Testing one, two, three. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. This is Engineer Masood of Tarkiani. And uh, as usual, today we have the technical session number 174. And uh, our subject is uh, concrete cover in the major structural concrete or any other concrete where we will cost. So uh, before going ahead, I would like to request you to subscribe press the bell icon in order to reach the next video with the easy access. So concrete cover is the major uh, concrete cover is a major uh, structural factor in order to control the uh, so many things uh, in the shape of the cover space. So the cover space of the concrete, we will discuss in uh, with the reference of the standard uh, ACI 130. And in the reinforced concrete, it is a last distance between the surface of embedded reinforcement and the outer surface of the concrete. So meaning the internal, it should be 65% and external is the 35%. And then it will be, if we combine this both, it will be the 100%. So from inside the cover is 65%, it should be more, but generally it should be comply according to the design parameters and uh, whatever the contract specification and the local buildings code, this we will cover this one. The concrete cover, the depth of is the measure in the cover meter. The purpose of this cover is to protect the reinforcement from the corrosion, fire, and the other potential damages. Whatever it is coming, it is controlled by the uh, cover, this safety factor. The required concrete cover depends upon the several factors, including the environmental condition and which the structural concrete will be exposed. The size of the reinforcement steel, the concrete strength, and the type of the structural uh, being constructed. Generally, the larger diameter reinforcement requires more concrete cover than the smaller uh, rebars sizes. In most cases, the local building codes and the engineering standards specify the minimum required concrete cover in the various structures is the different uh, uh, different uh, in uh, numbers and the shapes and the in the different scenarios so it is important to adhere the these requirements to ensure the safety and the uh, longevity of the structure in order to cover all the safety uh, measures so purpose of the concrete cover is to, it must be have a minimum thickness of the three main reason. Uh, number one, to protect the steel reinforcement bars from the environmental effects to prevent their corrosion. This is the one. The second one, to provide the thermal insulation which protect the in reinforcement bars from the fire and the other impact damages. And number three, to give the reinforcing bars sufficient embedding uh, to enable them to be stressed without the slipping and uh, any other uh, fractional or the uh, structural movement, uh, whatever it is affected, it will be, it should be covered. So national code also specifies the minimum cover other based on the respective local exposure condition and generally to cover the design parameters. The other national concrete covers requires also the country code ranges of the concrete in the MM. Uh, I will give the example for the some countries like in UK. Uh, oh, the reference is BS8110, is, the range is from the 25 to 50 mm. Then in Europe, EN1992 EC2 diameter 
10 to 25, uh, 10 to 55 mm. In USA, United States, uh, standard ACI 318 40 And in Australia, AS3600 standard from 15 to uh, 78. And in India, IS 456 uh, in 2000, it is revised 20 to 75. So in different countries, uh, have the different building codes according to their environmental condition and the weathering condition and uh, whatsoever this uh, uh, strategy of the regional and the geographic and whatsoever. And uh, every country have different standard and according to that standard and the building codes, they fix some basic parameters, but mostly it is covered on the uh, design parameters and uh, it should comply with the generally local codes and the international codes as well also. So these are the just uh, example for the concrete covers. So concrete cover make also a concrete uh, fire rated concrete. Also it can be fire rated, it can be thermal insulation and it can be safe from the different impact damages. So uh, this was the briefing about the concrete cover, which is uh, a major factor for the cover space in order to uh, covers and uh, handle the different uh, scenario in respect to the design parameters and the local building codes. So thank you very much. In next video, we will see each other with another subject. Uh, see you again and uh, have a nice day.